Oh dear. Is it broken? No, it's not broken. Hello, I'm back. I've got a cloth. I've got a roast going in the oven. And I've decided, because that's going to take about two hours. So at the same time, I'm going to try and clean my house. Not in hello Ian, Ian's in his cot, I'll show you him in a minute. Not including doing the sheets. Of course I've done those. Not today, but they've been done. So I'm gonna cook a roast dinner, Ian. And dust everything. So right tip in here. I haven't been about for a couple of days, have I? Friday I had a day watching box sets with the girls and I finished knitting all of the teddy bear, the bunny jumpers. Yesterday I had a day of, um, sorry I'm just looking at Ian, I had a day of making bunnies and this morning I've been finishing some off but I hope to get them completely done, packaged up and out either by tomorrow afternoon or first thing Tuesday. So I've just had a, a busy time catching up. Well, it doesn't sound that busy, does it? But I've, I've, I have, I've got a lot of work done over the last couple of days. But everything else needs a good spruce up. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm hot, I'm about to take this cardigan off. I'll show you my little Ian. Oh, is Betty looking after you? It's Betty. I just love him. I love him so much. I cry. <laughs> oh, look who I've found. So, you might hear weird noises in the background. That's Ian just making his noises that he makes. Hello, Pauline. Oh, how are you? Oh, some of you will have met. Um, Pauline at the East Anglian Yarn Festival. Jasper was there as well. Did you like meeting everybody, Pauline? No, they were all boring. <gasps> oh, look what's turned up whilst I've not been about with you. I've been about in the house, but you haven't seen me. It's this fabric I was telling you about. It's so lovely. I'm going to put it in the washing machine. It's 100% cotton. I'm going to make some bags out of it. But I don't know whether to make big bags or use little bits of it and make some patchwork ones. Maybe I could do a few of each because I've got a little bit of it. I just love it. Isn't it lovely? It was um, sold to me as vintage 1977. Is 1977 vintage these days? It must be. I suppose it is. That was a long time ago, wasn't it? But it's lovely. I'm going to put it in the washing machine and then try and think of... Uh, well, I think I know what I'm going to do with it. I think some patchwork bags would just be lovely using all these different bits yeah I really like it I'm really pleased with it it's much nicer than I was expecting and it feels a lot nicer than I was expecting too yeah so I'll keep you posted on this the roast has been eaten and it was very very nice the potatoes come out wonderfully but there weren't any parsnips available and I've seen somebody post on Facebook saying that they couldn't get hold of any parsnips. So there must be something going on. I expect they're out of season, aren't they? Anyway, Johnny has got a record player now. My dad gave him one. My dad is a... He... Um, I want to say dealer. He deals in um, vinyl records, like 45s. And... He's given Johnny a, a record player. Maybe I'll show it to you tomorrow because it is really nice. He's given them, given him all the Beatles albums as well. 
and that's just been playing full blast so i had to tell him to turn it down i've just laid out my pixie yarn blanket on the floor all the little squares because i'm going to sew them together i don't know if i'm going to do this tonight but i wanted to get my layout correct how i want it to be and i have so i'll show it to you i'll just flip you around that's what people say don't they i'll just flip you around I'll just flip you around now the white ones are a little bit bigger than the coloured ones but it will be fine once I stitch it together. I've practised here stitching and I, I like how it looks. So we're going to go from blue to bluey green and then I'm following the colours round like that. I did wonder whether to dot the colours all over. Oh, I don't know, I haven't tried laying that out. No, I like it like this, because um, I think that this colour, I think Sophie said it comes back at the end. So you will, I want to see the colour graduation go up. So it ends with this lovely sort of sandy colour. Whatever's going to be next, I can't wait to find out. But yeah, I'm really pleased with it. I think that the colours... Let me see if I can get it in a nice. I've got a few ends to stitch in, as you can see. I started off with good intentions, but um, oh, that won't take me long, will it? But now I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a picture of this. So what I'm doing, look, 15 across, and then they're going to go by four. So I've worked it out and I've laid out the things to go that way so the finished blanket will because there's four packs there will be four packs with six minis in each one and I've got the DK version so my finished blanket will be 15 by 16 and I like the size of that so I'm out of breath because I'm bending over hang on Ooh, my abdomen was all squashed because of the food and just being bent over in general. I can't remember what I was talking about now. Well, I know it was the blanket, but I don't know. I don't think I've got a lot more to say to you now, really. So I think I'll say goodbye and good night to you all. The weather's not supposed to be as good tomorrow, so uh I don't mind that at all, like the rain. I love the rain. I love a rainy day. Hang on. Hmm. Thought there was someone coming down. Yep, love a rainy day. And tomorrow it is double raindrop. A double raindrop rain at about nine o'clock, which will be just lovely. Oh, look what I've just done. Smudged everything. Right, so let's see what, what's been good today. I've got a good lay-in. Last night I stayed up late to watch, believe it or not, you're going to think, what are you on about? I stayed up until one o'clock to watch, um, I went to bed at one o'clock last night because I watched, I watched um, Coachella. <laughs> yeah, I actually did. So I watched that for a, a little, there was one person who I wanted to see, so I stayed up and watched them. Then I went to bed. So I had a lay-in today. That was very nice. And then I had a cup of tea and, well, I had two cups of coffee in bed. James bought me one up. Then I went and got a refill, refill with a bowl of porridge and read my book. Oh, that was just lovely. Does that count as two? Yes, I'd say so. And... um Oh, I've got to go and iron a shirt. I need to get a bit more organised for tomorrow morning. I've just got to get a shirt ironed for Lizzie. But everybody goes back to college and school tomorrow. But I've got a lot of house stuff done today as well. I've got a lot of bunny making done today. Done today as well. I'm well, way, way ahead of schedule with those. So if you've ordered one, they should be going out tomorrow or tuesday at the latest 
course has been half term it's the jumper knitting that normally slows me down because it's hard to fit it in but I put it on sale knowing that I had two weeks of half term and also because Lizzie's a bit like an only child at the minute because the other two are nearly 18 and they've been at work and things like that it has just been me and Lizzie for the majority of the time and um you know I like I like hanging out with her she's she's a laugh so I've pla I planned the teddy bear club because I knew that I would be able to do that and spend time with her at the same time so that's how I've managed to um to get it done a lot quicker than I normally do because I haven't had any time at my sewing machine at all because well, I just haven't, but that's coming next week and I'm really looking forward to it, to get some more bags going. I love Teddy Bear Club, but I, I love making bags as well. And I've got so many ideas that I need to get out. I'm watching a lovely bird over there pecking the grass, looking for worms. He's so busy. Um, What else was I going to say to you? Hmm. I don't know. I need to go and iron that shirt whilst it's in my head. All right, everybody. I'll see you soon. Um, Hopefully tomorrow, but we'll see. Goodbye.